You are looking at what many called a surprise tornado that tore through downtown Buffalo yesterday afternoon. The National Weather Service confirming the EF1 tornado touched down just before 1 o'clock yesterday. Good morning and thanks so much for joining us here in your morning on Spectrum News 1. I'm Dan Bazil. And I'm Julie Chapman. Just when we got through a round of tornadoes last week, yesterday's in the afternoon, it caught many off guard, just weren't expecting it in the city of Buffalo. It was the 26th of the season in New York, setting a record. Our Brianna Foos is back with us right now. She's showing us how the cleanup stands this morning. Good morning, Bree. Well, guys, we're just going to give you a look at the cleanup right now. Take a look at this. Street sweepers out already this morning. We have heard chainsaws. We have heard those tree grinders as, you know, they're trying to get rid of the dozens of trees that were just destroyed um, by this EF1 tornado this morning. And then uh, we have this building here. There's a story behind this. I don't know if you can see it um, very well, uh, but there's a, a bunch of black marks in between those two windows there on the second story. That's from a roof, a roof that came a quarter mile away. It was ripped off a building, um, Niagara Strait here in downtown Buffalo, thrown there. There were two men outside working on light fixtures. Um, they had to frantically get inside. They said it went still, and then all of a sudden there was a change in wind direction. They saw the tornado coming, and here's what happened next. And so we got inside the building, and um, we look out front here, and the roof of that building over there came off, smashed into the side of the building and we were working. But luckily we got inside, and everything was okay after that. But within like 40 seconds, it was over. And back to that cleanup, you could hear all those chainsaws behind Jesse there as cleanup continues. And Kenny here showing you just another bit of damage here. Third of that prospect, that car just crunched by a tree that has since been removed. But all in all, guys, okay, so this tornado went 1.4 miles. The top wind speed was 90 miles per hour. As we've been saying all morning, there was no warning. This seemingly just came up off of Lake Erie where it converges with the Niagara River and it just came across Buffalo. But you guys, everyone's just counting their blessings that no one was injured and no one was killed. It was absolutely uh, lots of angels watching over everyone, right? Just unbelievable. Within seconds and minutes, it caused all that damage. What makes it so goodness. frightening is by the time people realize what's happening, mm -hmm. it's gone. It's gone. Wow. Bree, yep. thank you. And as always, be sure to share any images of severe weather with us this summer. You can do so by scanning the QR code that you see right there on your screen. Thank you for watching our YouTube channel. For more stories in your communities, click the subscribe button right here. You can also download our app or watch us on TV for the latest information, balanced coverage, weather updates every 10 minutes and more. We'll see you then.